For the last home game of the season, the Whitney Wildcats were hoping for their eighth win in a memorable senior night with nine seniors on the team. And coming into the game, one of Antelope's captains, senior Ben Kitkanovic, leads the CVC in goals with 24 in just 11 games. Let's start things off in the first half of the game where Whitney stops the Titans' offensive drive and sends the ball up to Wildcat number 13, Brandon Sterry, who gets the assist to number 10, Nate Sherwood. Sherwood would make his way past the two Titan defenders and find the back of the net for the first goal of the game. This would be Whitney's only lead, one to nothing. Later in the first half, junior Zach Mason receives a yellow card for this foul. Mason got subbed out, which allowed Antelope's number 18, Ben Kikanovic, to score the go-ahead goal with five minutes remaining. The score was 2-1 Antelope going into the half. In the second half, after a quick Whitney goal, Wildcat sophomore Jake Kirkland fails to block Kikanovic's goal attempt in the 63rd minute of the game. Then Whitney junior number three, Marcus Tovar, clears it off the line, keeping the score 2-2. Two to two. With only seven minutes remaining in the game, Titan number eight, Ryan Mersan, finds a hole in the Whitney defense and sends this shot to the back of the net to break the tie. This would be the winning goal that would put Antelope on top, 3-2. to two. The Wildcats would not be able to respond to the late goal and would fall to the Titans, 3-2, to two, in their last game of the season. I would like to add that this team that I'm part of right here, because this is my last year coaching, that it has just been inspiring. We need three goals tonight. Three goals a night, and we probably win this game. Um, so, and I still feel that way. I mean, yeah, they they got three, but you know, we we gifted them a couple goals. Reporting for WCTV 19 with photographer Perry Nguyen, I'm Sierra Bedrin.